You haven't played any Belgian festivals, but you have played at Pink Pop. I saw you there, uh, a Dutch festival. And one of the things um, that I really remember about the show is that you took off your shirt. Uh, do you have any of those plans uh, for us here in Belgium as well? That depends how hot it gets later. If it's yeah. if it starts raining and it's really cold, maybe yeah. we'll put on jackets. It's pretty hot, so uh, yeah, yeah, I think we'll take off our shirts. Yeah. There's you, a risk. There's a risk of us taking our shirts I think off. It's called a chance when it's a good thing. That's how you look at it. <laughs> is it a risk or is it a chance? You can answer that. But that depends who's looking. Um, exactly. Who would you like to be looking? Beautiful girls <laughs> and uh, people who uh, like our music. Yeah. We know you from two major hit singles, uh, Seven Years and Mama Said. Uh, one of the things that really um, stands out and is that is the fact that actually it's about your parents a lot. How important are your parents for you? I think for all of us in the in the crew of Lucas Graham, you can say the musicians and the management and the producers and the songwriters that I work with a lot, that we're all very family orientated. Um, and I don't think it's anything like, I don't think we all run around with this idea that, oh, we want to make a big family, everyone, each and every one of us with, uh, with babies and everything. But we just all have really strong families where we came from. We also have songs called Drunk in the Morning and Why, How Come You Don't Strip No More. So it's not all about the family. No, but family is an important thing. Do you do one for yourselves? Uh, uh, a big family with a dog and trees in the backyard. How do you picture your, your futures? Also family orientated? Well, I'm, I'm getting a little baby girl in four or five weeks, so uh, I'm kind of already starting. Oh, seriously, I didn't know that. Congratulations. Thank you. Do you have a name already? No, no. We'll have to wait and see what she looks like. In four or five weeks? That's so soon. And here you are, taking off clothes at festivals. Is that what you call uh, fatherly behavior in Denmark? No, I would call it a paradox lifestyle. <laughs> Uh, but no, I think fatherly figures can do can be naked if they want to be. Yeah. Thank you that you were able to uh, uh, speak Dutch with me and uh, congratulations on the fatherhood and enjoy your time here at Pukkapop. Thank you.